threatened. In the vast wilderness that our planet is, there resides an intriguing array of creatures, each with their unique pace of life. Some animals are built for speed, others for strength, but then there are those who embrace the slow lane, living life at a leisurely pace. It's a fascinating concept, isn't it? The idea that some animals by nature move slowly, but why is that? How does their sluggish pace play into their survival? Well, it turns out that moving slowly can be a survival strategy. It allows these slowpokes to conserve energy, avoid detection, and even outwit predators. Understanding this aspect of animal behavior opens up a new perspective on how diverse and balanced our ecosystem truly is. Every creature, no matter how fast or slow, has its place in the grand scheme of things. Without further ado, let's dive into the countdown of the top 10 slowest animals in the world. Starting our countdown at number 10, we have the manatee. This serene creature, also known as a sea cow, hails from the warm coastal waters and rivers of the Americas and West Africa. Manatees are distinguished by their large, paddle-like flippers and a body that can grow up to 13 feet long. Despite their size, these gentle giants are surprisingly graceful swimmers. They navigate their aquatic home at a leisurely pace of about 5 miles per hour. Their slow movement isn't due to lack of ability but rather a lifestyle choice. Manatees are herbivores, spending most of their day grazing on underwater plants. They're not in a hurry because, well, their food isn't going anywhere. The pace of the manatee reflects its tranquil, non-aggressive nature. They are known to be incredibly peaceful, even friendly, often approaching humans without fear. So the next time you find yourself rushing, remember the manatee. These gentle sea cows certainly know how to take life at a leisurely pace. Coming in at number 9, meet the Gila Monster. This reptilian wonder is the only venomous lizard native to the United States. Found primarily in the southwestern deserts, the Gila Monster spends over 90% of its life underground, emerging only to feed and occasionally bask in the desert sun. Its unique characteristics include a thick, bumpy skin that resembles a beaded bracelet and a venomous bite delivered through grooved teeth. But don't worry, these creatures are non-aggressive and rarely seen by humans. So why is the Gila Monster one of the slowest animals? The answer lies in its energy conservation strategy. This lizard has a low metabolic rate and can store fat in its large tail, allowing it to go months between meals. This survival mechanism means it doesn't need to rush about, favoring a leisurely pace instead. For the Gila Monster, slow and steady certainly wins the race. At number 8 we find the graceful seahorse. This fascinating creature is a marvel of the marine world, known for its unique appearance and slow-paced lifestyle. Seahorses inhabit the shallow, temperate waters of the world, where they camouflage themselves among seagrasses and coral reefs. One of the most distinctive characteristics of the seahorse is its upright posture, a feature that sets it apart from other fish. They have a long, snout-like mouth which they use to suck in tiny plankton and small crustaceans, their preferred diet. But what makes this tiny creature one of the slowest swimmers in the ocean? The answer lies in its delicate, fin-like wings. Unlike most fish that have strong, powerful tails for propulsion, seahorses rely on their small, pectoral fins for movement. These fins flutter rapidly, but only propel the seahorse at a leisurely pace. The seahorse proves that speed is not everything in the underwater world. Moving to land, our seventh slowest animal is the adorable koala. Native to the land down under Australia, koalas are fascinating creatures, known for their cuddly appearance and their eucalyptus diet. Koalas are marsupials, not bears as often misconceived, and they spend most of their lives in eucalyptus trees. These trees not only provide koalas with food, but also a safe haven from predators. A typical day for a koala involves 19 to 20 hours of sleep, making them one of the most sedentary creatures on the planet. Their slow lifestyle can be attributed to their diet. Eucalyptus leaves, while plentiful, are low in nutrition and high in fibrous matter. This means koalas need to conserve energy to digest their food, leading to their slow, languid movement. The koala's slow pace is not a disadvantage, but a survival strategy. In the harsh Australian environment, they have adapted to make the most of what's available to them. In the world of the koala, slow is the way to go. Halfway through our countdown, at number 6, we have the giant tortoise. These creatures are renowned for their longevity and their unhurried pace. Found primarily in two remote island groups, the Seychelles and the Galapagos, these massive reptiles embody the spirit of slow living. The giant tortoise can reach lengths of up to 4 feet and weigh as much as 500 pounds. Their lifespan is also extraordinary, with many living well beyond 100 years. 
Their slow movement is largely due to their size and the need to conserve energy in their harsh habitats. These tortoises are herbivores, munching at a leisurely pace on grass, leaves, and cactus fruit. Their slow, steady chewing aids digestion and helps them extract maximum nutrients from their food. The giant tortoise is not just about slow physical movement, but also about slow, steady growth and long life. It's a reminder that speed is not always the key to survival. The giant tortoise, a testament to the power of patience and persistence. At number 5 we meet an animal synonymous with slowness, the sloth. This fascinating creature takes a leisurely approach to life, moving at a pace that's nothing short of languid. Originating from the tropical rainforests of Central and South America, the sloth spends most of its life hanging from trees thanks to its remarkably strong grip. In the fourth spot, we find the starfish. A quintessential symbol of the sea, the starfish, also known as sea stars, are not actually fish but echinoderms. They're found in every ocean around the globe, from frigid polar waters to the balmy tropics. Starfish are unique in many ways, one of which is their slow movement. They travel by using hundreds of tube feet located on their underside. The tube feet work in unison, allowing the starfish to move along the ocean floor at a leisurely pace. This slow movement is not a disadvantage, however, it's actually a survival strategy. With a tough, calcified skin that protects them from most predators, the starfish doesn't need to rush. Their slow, steady pace allows them to methodically search for their prey, usually clams and mussels. They have a unique feeding method where they can eject their stomachs out of their bodies to envelop and digest their prey. The starfish, showing us that speed is not a necessity in the vast ocean. On the podium at number 3 we have the snail. Now, there's an animal that truly embodies the phrase, slow and steady wins the race. Snails are gastropods, a group of mollusks known for their distinctive shells and slow pace. They are found worldwide, from your garden to the deepest parts of the ocean. Interestingly, snails carry their homes on their backs, a spiral shell that provides protection and a place to retreat when danger lurks. This home, however, is also a reason for their slow pace. The weight of the shell restricts their speed but it's a small price to pay for safety. Another factor contributing to their leisurely pace is their method of movement. Snails move using a muscular foot that contracts and expands creating a wave-like motion. It's not quick, but it's reliable. Snails may not be the fastest creatures but their resilience and adaptability are truly remarkable. The humble snail, demonstrating that slow can also mean steady. Just missing out on the top spot, at number 2, we have the slug. Meet the slug, a gastropod mollusk that has truly mastered the art of slow motion. These creatures are found in a variety of habitats around the world, from the deepest forests to the most common gardens. What makes the slug so slow you may ask? Well, they move using a muscular foot which contracts and expands to propel them forward. This foot secretes a slimy mucus that helps them glide along the ground. But that's not all. The slug's slow pace is also a survival strategy, allowing it to conserve energy and stay under the radar of potential predators. Unique in form and function, slugs do not have shells like their snail cousins, and instead, they carry a small internal shell, hidden within their soft, slimy bodies. This lack of shell further contributes to their lack of speed but it doesn't hold them back from living life in the slow lane. The slug, a creature that truly embodies the art of slow living. And now, for the slowest animal in the world, the three-toed sloth. This arboreal marvel is a native of the Americas, making its home in the tropical rainforests. Its most striking characteristic is, of course, its speed, or rather its lack thereof. The three-toed sloth is a master of slow motion, traveling at a leisurely pace of about 400 meters per day. That's one of the slowest rates in the animal kingdom. But why so slow, you might wonder? Well, it's all about survival. The sloth's diet mainly consists of leaves which are low in calories and take a long time to digest. By moving slowly the sloth conserves energy. Its slow movement also helps it stay under the radar, making it less likely to be spotted by predators. The sloth's lifestyle is a fascinating study in how an animal can adapt to its environment and thrive. The three-toed sloth, a living testament to the beauty of slow-paced life in nature. And there you have it, the top 10 slowest animals in the world, from the gentle floating pace of the manatee to the languid crawl of the gila monster, we've seen how nature often values patience over speed. The seahorse with its slow and steady swim, and the koala who spends most of its life dozing in the trees, remind us that there's no rush when it comes to living life. 
Next, we moved on to the giant tortoise whose longevity is a testament to its unhurried existence. The sloth, starfish and snail came up next, each defining slow in their unique ways. The slug showed us that even without a shell, slow and steady can still win the race. And finally, the undisputed champion of slow, the three-toed sloth, a creature so slow, algae grows on its fur. Next time you're in a rush, remember these creatures, and the grace they find in taking life one slow step at a time.